Pluto. We are learning about all of the planets in the solar system. Today, we are focusing on our favorite former planet, Pluto. Pluto is about 3.67 billion miles away from the sun and one of the farthest known objects in our solar system. Once considered the ninth planet in our solar system, Pluto has an interesting backstory. Named after the Roman god of the underworld, Pluto was discovered in 1930 by an astronomer named Clyde Tombaugh. Here is an interesting fact. An 11-year-old girl named Venetia Burney was the one who suggested the name. True or false, Pluto is one of the closest known objects in the solar system. False. Pluto is a tiny icy place. Its diameter is only about half the width of the United States. Pluto's surface is covered with nitrogen ice, and its thin atmosphere is made of nitrogen and traces of methane and carbon monoxide. Temperatures are frigid, and the planet's surface has mountains made of ice, long troughs, and valleys. Large craters are also present as are smooth plains made of frozen nitrogen gas. Fill in the blank. Pluto's surface is covered with blank ice. Nitrogen. When scientists first discovered Pluto, they called it the ninth planet in our solar system. At the time, Pluto fit the criteria to be a planet. First, because it orbited the sun, and second, because it was large enough to be shaped into a sphere by gravity. For more than 70 years, Pluto held its place as the last planet in our solar system. About how long was Pluto considered a planet? 70 years. The year 2006 brought about a huge Pluto-related change. The International Astronomical Union, or IAU, created a new definition of a planet. To qualify, a celestial body must orbit the sun, be spherical in shape due to its own gravity, and have cleared its orbit of other debris. Pluto met the first two criteria, but not the third. This is because it shares its orbit with objects in the Kuiper Belt, which is a region of icy bodies located beyond the planet Neptune. So Pluto was reclassified as a dwarf planet. Fill in the blank. In 2006, Pluto was reclassified as a blank planet. Dwarf. Pluto has five moons. Charon, Nix, Hydra, Kerberos, and Styx. Charon is about half Pluto's size, and they orbit around each other. Charon is so big compared to Pluto that the two are sometimes referred to as a double planet. Scientists believe that Charon's surface is water ice, unlike Pluto's icy nitrogen crust. Pluto's other moons are much smaller than Charon, but no less intriguing. Name two of Pluto's moons. Possible answers. Charon. Nix, Hydra, Kerberos, and Styx. Even though it is no longer considered a planet, Pluto is still a vital part of our solar system and holds many mysteries just waiting to be discovered. Perhaps one day, you will become a scientist and develop new techniques that will help us study this amazing dwarf planet. Hope you had fun learning with us visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.